Let's make sure our Pokemon are healed. Uh, but I think we match up really well against this. All right, so let's see what the trial is. Welcome to the Canyon Plaza, where the team that supports Ameris of the Elite Four. And you're Dave, right? One of the BB League challengers? You'll need to hand over 50 BP if you want to take on the Elite Trial here. I will pay, I suppose. Thank you very much. Duly received and noted. Now, here she comes, our very own Ameris. Dave, yes. As you see, I'm present and ready for your trial. A change of location is required. Come. The decision to allow you to take the, on the league was irregular, an exception among exceptions. I was against it, as you know. But the Academy allowed it, and their ruling is absolute. Therefore, I will carry out my duty as a member of the Elite Four as flawlessly as I always do. The Elite Trial I devise starts right here. I call my challenge the Flying Time Trial. You will need to fly around the skies of the Terrarium while riding a Pokemon. Reach the goal within the prescribed time, and you will pass the trial. Fly through the Magnemite Rings, and extra time will be added to the countdown. I recommend you go through as many rings as possible as you fly toward the goal. Can you verify that you're ready and willing to take on my flying time trial? Sure. Let's do it. Understood. I assume you have a Pokemon to ride on. Please bring it out of its ball. Ah, good. With some effort, this Pokemon should be capable of flight. Your name is Aegeus, yes? This is for you to eat. <laughs> Maridon is brimming with power! What your Aegeus just consumed is a supplement that enhances a Pokemon's flight capabilities. I prepared it using the leaves of a mysterious plant that was found growing in the terrarium. Your Aegeus will be able to soar through the skies as it pleases, but only for the duration of the trial. To reach the goal within the time limit by flying on Maridon's back, passing through Magnemite Rings will grant you extra time. You can fly freely in any direction using the left stick. Uh, move the left stick up to fly down. Uh, can I change that? You have all you need to begin the challenge. I wish you luck. Can can I change the control? Can I, can I? All right. I have to invert... An X axis flight controls. It just doesn't work for me. My brain cannot comprehend it. Please let me change these. These, uh, these controls. I will fail. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, I can't change it. Oh no. Alright, this isn't so bad. I just gotta think about it really hard. <laughs> oh, moving the camera might help. Oh, no! Oh, I, I got it. <laughs> Alright, this is easy. This is easy. Easy sauce. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy and all that other good stuff. Look at that, for the best. Around! Cleared, let's go. It's all it takes, it's all it takes. Simply constructed alternatively and such. <clears throat> that was an impressive display of punctuality. I must admit, it was satisfying to watch you fly. Congratulations, you have cleared my elite trial. Now a change of location is required once again. Come. 
Now it's battle time. You've earned the right to face me in battle. Do you wish to begin? Let's do it. Are you ready to get Typhlosioned? Understood. Let's assume our battle positions. Position assumed. There is one thing I wanted to ask you. It concerns Kieran. What is he to you, Dave? He's my rival! We are... We are rivals. We are. That's what we are. So, you consider him a worthy adversary. I see. For my part, Kieran is the younger brother of my f dear friend, Carmen. Something in him has changed. He is not his usual self. I find this deeply concerning. If possible, I want to be the one to help him. That being the case, I cannot afford to lose. Our battle starts now. She's got a heavy ball. All right, we got a Lowland Doug Trio in Skarmory. Uh, I'm a little worried about the Doug Trio. Get ready, Skarmory. You too, Doug Trio. We're finishing the battle right on schedule. Or should I say, right on schedule. Uh, so we're doing this. We're gonna Tailwind. Get that nice prankster going. Um, I don't. I would not doubt it if they like target down Winsicott here. Double sturdy! Love it. You love to see it. An unfavorable tight matchup. You caught me off guard. Now my glasses have fogged up. Yeah, double double sturdies. Oh, it had a focus sash. Okay, okay. I'm I'm picking up what you're putting down. Iron head. Uh did not take me to my sash. Funnily enough. Did not take me to my sash. Uh, so we can just eruption again, and then we can probably get a nice clean swap into Kinkelder here. And then we can just kind of single target everything from here on out and probably be fine. Kinkelder, the reliable partner. Yeah. So... I'm a little concerned about the next. Oh, we got Reuniclus. Oh. Empoleon. Um, I did not expect Reuniclus to be here. I will admit. <laughs> um, I did. Uh, I I didn't didn't expect it. Um, I guess we're gonna mock punch the Empoleon. Uh, because it does get Aqua Jet, if I'm not mistaken, but, like, uh, that one's a, that one's a tough one, because, like, Empoleon can be built physically, but, like, is it? Oh, Mach Punch didn't kill it, so, it does not use Aqua Jet, so that's fine. If Typhlosion goes down, Typhlosion goes down. Um... Ooh, Terra Flamethrower did not do it. We do see the Hydra Pump. Typhlosion does go down. Not uh, the best of circumstances. And um, Uniclus is going to get Trick Room. Oh, no. All right, that's fine. Uh, we have priority moves. Our Tailwind will go down in a couple turns. So this isn't the worst of scenarios. Could be worse. So that's why Reuniclus is here. Um, so yeah, we're going to bullet punch the Reuniclus and then we're just gonna mock punch the Empoleon again. Cause that'll take Empoleon and then <sighs> Reuniclus should be low enough that a stab bullet punch, we'll take it out. So bad luck can always play a role in battles. That's good to know, thank you. That did not, that did not matter, Amaris. I will, um, that didn't matter. That, it did not. Your Empoleon was going down, like, 12 ways this Sunday, so. 
Oh, we're life orb too, so. Alright, Tailwind is gone. Uh, so we see Metagross. And Scizor. <sighs> yeah, I'm 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 too old to to deal with uh, the ticking and the talking. Um Nice. Where was your uh, where was your vacation, Mitch? Time is short. Let's wrap it up. Oh, we're going to see a Terrasalization. Fun, fun, fun. Who is getting Terrid? The Metagross. Okay. Um, so that, like, makes our... The knockoff is good damage. Oh, we knocked off the Expert Belt. So that'll be nice, especially with a Zen Headbutt coming our way. Yikeronis. Trailblaze. Okay, King Kelder's fine. Speed Rose, that's that's good for us. That's good for us. Alright, so as long as Yeah, so we just Thunder Punch here and then we can drain punch the Metagross. And I think we're good because we're getting stab off Drain Punch. Yeah. Easy peasy. And there's in the, the Thunder Punch. I will see a Trailblaze. King Kelder is uh, refilled of enough of its HP. Uh, we should be good. Yeah, we're well within range. Alright, Ameris is defeated. Great work from the team here. Fantastic work, if you will. I am not enough. I see. 25 grand arena not a not a bad sum of cash for sure for sure the strength of one's pokemon reflects the strength of one's beliefs your desire to help kieran is evidently greater than my own <laughs> i'll be nice i promise dave you truly are a kind person all right then Time for a photo. We must ensure that your victory here is properly commemorated. <laughs> She's just very, uh, very deadpan. I like it though. <laughs> I will give you this TM too. It contains a favorite move of mine. Hard press. Target is crushed with an arm, a claw, or the like. <laughs> to inflict damage. The more HP the target has left, the greater the move's power. So it's Steel Eruption. It is up to you to help Kieran, Dave. I entrust my wish to you. Time for me to go. So long. Yo, yo! Champ in the making. So that's two Elite Four members down already, huh? You sure are crushing it. And Mara sure leaves an impression, huh? It's wild seeing her and Carmen talk. You'd never guess it, but they click in a weird way. It's pretty funny to watch. The thing about Amaris is, as rigid as she looks, she's got a sensitive streak a mile wide. Remember that about her, okay? Even if it's hard to tell from outside. Seems like things are going well with the BB League, right, Dave? What's up, mighty champion? Scoping out the competition. I was getting worried. It'd be so disappointing if David had gotten weaker. But you seem as strong as ever, thankfully. Dave, go all the way. Don't go losing. I can't show you how strong I've gotten if you don't even make it to me. <laughs> Someone's good and riled up. Anyway, you got places to be, right? I better not keep you. See ya. Good luck with the remaining elite, too. You're one of them, Drayton. <laughs>